Welcome back, my friends, to a brand new episode of our Minecraft Ender Dragon UHC. So, if you guys missed last episode of the link down below in the description, it was not that great of an episode, not gonna lie. We uh, did actually die to a creeper, and after we died, there were like two other creepers that came by me during that time. But, I had to delete that world and reload kind of the previous, so I think it was like episode, what is it, maybe episode three's world save or four i don't know i don't remember what episode we're on but i had to uh reload the previous the previous episode's world save and that is where we had um what is it we had uh so two hearts of damage and these are all the resources we had so all the stuff that i got on last episode i don't have anymore so i think last episode we mainly found just the end portal found a little bit of gold so the end portal won't be like the thing we have to go look for now since um, we know where it is, I already have a screenshot of it. I don't have to go re-find it. We'll eventually want to find it again, obviously, because we'll have to go there to fight the Ender Dragon. But um, I have a screenshot of it, so it's not. we don't have to really go there right now. <clears throat> but something I did want to do today was actually hopefully get diamonds. Now, we looked for diamonds last episode underground, but we couldn't find any. Um, someone recommended strip mining, and I might do that, at least for a little bit. Not like a long time, but maybe for a bit we'll strip mine. But I wanted to at least try first to go find another cave. So, um, to do that, we're going to just have to go explore because there's really no other close caves. Um, like, very close caves uh, next to us. So, we got to go look for that. Um, but first off, I actually am going to make another bed. We'll sleep first here. But I'm going to make another bed just in case it is night when we're exploring this episode. Um, we'll just have another bed. Maybe we can even build another uh, temporary shelter um, if we just want to or just need to. If we go uh, very, very far. So we'll see, we'll see. But let's uh, get our bed, our backup bed, I guess you could say, made right now. Um, we have lots of good materials, good resources on us. We'll take a lot of food. Might as well. Doesn't hurt. Um, is there anything else we could really use right now? We have some tools. Um, we could make... Eh, actually, we don't need that really. We don't, we'll, we'll take a bit of iron. We'll take that bit much of iron. All right. Looks like we're all uh, ready to go. Should we get some coal maybe? Take a little bit of coal on us. Do we have any uh, stone? We'll take that. It doesn't matter. I mean, it does matter if we die. I don't want to die, obviously. But um, if we do die, at least uh, we'll have to reload from the previous episode. So we won't have to restart completely. Otherwise, the series could take forever. Someone did say that they wanted me to restart the world every time I die. And I was just like, man, I could. But it could take absolutely ages if I do that. I don't want to risk it. But another thing I actually wanted to do um, before... Before uh, we head out, or maybe just during today, is actually make a uh, an axe to clear out some of these trees. Because I was trying to do that on the last episode, so those mobs wouldn't spawn by us. But uh, they're always spawning under the trees, or staying under the trees after it's night. Um, just that's where they can find shelter. So I do want to uh, fix that up a little bit. But let's put some uh, some sugarcane down here. I want to start a sugarcane farm as well, so we'll get that going. Um, we don't really need the wood. It's just kind of annoying that we have to do this, but... Like I said, it's just the only thing we can really do at this point to not have the mobs uh, be very, very close to our house. Could even actually use this wood to make a little bit of a, a fence, fencing around this temporary shelter just to be extra safe, you know? We're still down two hearts, which is annoying. Um, that means we do eventually want to... We have we have enough gold to get, uh, I think, a couple golden apples, actually. But um, I don't know if I need to really do that right now since I only have two hearts. Like, those creepers, I have this on hard difficulty. So those creepers, at least I... Yeah, I have it on hard difficulty. So those creepers did even more damage than what we're used to probably seeing from just other Minecraft series. And um, also, I don't. I think I had all full, full iron armor on. So I don't know. Maybe I didn't have full iron armor on. At least I do now. So maybe I didn't. That's maybe why they did that much more damage and killed me. But hopefully, we won't see any other deaths uh, very soon. Hopefully, throughout not not anymore throughout the whole series. You know, that'd be amazing. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm just gonna clear out a few more trees here. And then get off to exploring. So, don't really know what direction to go to. Um, I haven't really gotten any comments that you guys have said on any uh, other good cave systems to explore. Other than just the end portal caves that we've already been in. So, hopefully these I'll just have to find on my own. And uh, they'll be not too far away from the house. So, I don't want to have to spend the whole episode just exploring. Because it'll take a long time to get back. And since I'm doing everything on camera, can't cut any parts out, you know? So, I got... Oh, yes, an apple. That's a random apple, too. That's awesome. Sweet. So, we got... Additional apple. We have, I think, a good amount now, which is uh, actually very, very successful. Like, that's um, that's something you just got to grind for. And I'm glad we already have a good amount of those. And by clearing out all these trees, some, some more apples might even drop from the leaves, which would be absolutely amazing. But I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, right now, I'm on, uh, what, what is it today? I think it's this video, I don't know when this video will go up. But um, right now, I'm on my spring break, which is um, basically 
a week off of school if you guys don't know and um starts for me i guess it started for me last friday so it was absolutely amazing it's feeling nice so far to have this break um but I'm going to try to get as many videos out for you guys as possible since I do have basically, a, a, I think, 10 days total off of school. So that's awesome. Not off, 10 days total off, um, five off of school. I think we got, yeah, a week off of school. So that's good. But it looks like uh, that's all the trees very, very close. If we want to clear out more, we can later. But let's get going. All right. So uh, we have multiple ways to go. There's that big cave that we saw over there. Ooh, it was cold down there, but not really good. But I think I want to go this way. This way, I don't think, uh, we've explored a little bit, looked at the extreme hills areas a tad, but we haven't really been, um, I guess a good, a good amount this way. So let's get, just get rid of the sheep and get some food, get some wool if we need that for anything else later down the road. Take an egg, why not? Take that, just for fun, just for funsies, you know? Take another one there. But let's get going. So there's these big caves that look big, but they're very, very high above the ground. I, honestly... Oh man, that was, I was scared I was going to fall there. They're very, very tall, like up here, but this is extreme, in Extreme Hills area. So, I mean, we're not going to be fi finding diamonds up here. So, we got to get lower. And I was hoping that one of these caves might lead to a lower part of this uh, Extreme Hills area. I don't know if it will, but I've not really had... I mean, I know if you guys are watching my Minecraft Xbox One adventure... Ooh, there's a cave that could be good over there. I see that. Um, you guys will know that I built my house actually on an Extreme Hills area, and there were loads of mine shafts around it, but that world's absolutely crazy. I don't know if that uh, is the case for all these other worlds. I'm going to actually grab a bit of sand, um, just so if we want to use it for something, we might just might need it for something down the road. Oh, and there's more sugar cane over there. So it's also a good kind of collecting episode as well, kind of regaining our feet from that uh, death on last episode. But I can't believe I died. Like, honestly, it was such a random thing, and I was just about to end the episode. Like, no jokes. I was honestly in the last, like, minute of the episode. I think I was just going to chop down that last tree, and then I died. And it was just like, no, why now? But, man, that's, uh, that's what keeps the series interesting, I guess, and not easy, by the way. It's not been easy at all so far. Oh, it was, okay, this is a pretty... Looks like pretty deep, but oh, that is what killed me on last episode, my friends. He is not a fun person or a fun thing, I should say, to be around. So let's hopefully uh, get rid of this guy. Explode! You can explode if you're down there, dude. I don't care. Oh, we only took two shots there. We got a crit on him. Um, and by the way, oh, okay. By the way, I also do need to kill some spiders here. So don't know what the best way to do this is. I'm just gonna try this. Any string? Oh, are you serious? No string. But I'm gonna try to get some string so I can make a bow because that will be. Oh, hey, zombie. Is there even anything over there? I don't think there is. I can just avoid this zombie, to be honest with you. Um, string is useful to make a bow, which I don't have yet. Eventually, I'll need to get a bow. I probably should get one now, to be honest with you. Uh, just so we can fight off mobs a little bit easier and from a farther distance. So that is one of the things on the priority list for us to do. I have not forgotten about a bow. I also need to enchant some stuff. I have some XP. I don't know how many I had at the end of last episode, but lost all that, sadly. I had to restart from 18. But it's all good. It's all good. Let's get down though and see what uh, see what's in this other cave over here. We've got a nice savanna biome, which I have not really been in too much. Um, I've not really done a Minecraft 1.8 series. This is, I think, my first one. So I've not really been in a savanna biome much other than, oh, that was close. Other than playing like by myself or with friends. Okay, I hear zombies. This is a, kind of a risky spot to be in, um, but we're just going to go for it. Hopefully not die. I need to get some blocks out, actually. That would probably be the best thing to have. All right, here, baby zombie, which is very scary. Ooh, okay, that's that's a normal zombie. He's not terrible, but I don't want this. Uh, I don't want a baby zombie to come after me. Those guys are freaking fast, dudes. All right, come on, dude, come on. Especially on since it's hard mode, they're gonna do a good amount of damage. I bet. All right, that's a big hole. Let's go, let's go. Let's be safe, though. The things I'm worried about are mainly just um, creepers and, yes, iron. Okay, that's not bad. Don't really need much iron anymore, but it's not bad. Creepers and skeletons. Maybe even skeletons more. And I mentioned this before. Just because skeletons, they're just brutal, man. Creepers you can kind of avoid somewhat, I guess. But, ooh, okay, that looks to be good. But skeletons are just the worst, honestly. All right, let's get this... Uh, this going. Let's go down here a little bit. Hopefully, this is not a death trap. Honestly, I still hear that. Where's that baby zombie? Oh shoot! I heard him fall. 
Don't know if that's good or bad, but I heard him fall. There's, this is a terrible cave, too, by the way. There's nothing else down here. I thought it'd go a little bit lower than this, but sadly it does not. So uh, I'm going to make maybe a lap around, back around home, back to our house, because it is maybe getting night. I do have that bed, but I'm going to try to just make it back home if I can, or maybe even uh, start the strip mining process, since, uh, since I said we would try that if we can't find any other caves. I haven't seemed to, found, just haven't seemed to find any very close to home. All right, this could change that, potentially, potentially. We will see. Is this even a cave? I can hardly see. Uh, yeah, not really. Yeah, not at all. Okay. Wow, so our luck with caves is not that great. Maybe it's because we're so close to the end room and stuff, end portal area, that uh, that's why it's not working out. But let's get back home, go back to the end portal, unless we find a cave on our way, and see... If our strip mining luck is uh, working out today, because we've already had done a little bit over 10 minutes on this episode, and I don't want to waste any more time um, knowing that diamonds aren't going to be around over there. I want to make sure I go strip mining, because then I, it, you're kind of almost guaranteed diamonds in a way, and hopefully I don't say guaranteed and then we don't find any, but somewhat, sometimes you are kind of guaranteed diamonds when you strip mine, just because uh, the likelihood of finding them is does increase a good amount. But let's get going first off, and get back to the house. So, <coughs> uh, pardon me. It seems like I haven't played this, or been on this series in a while, but uh, that's because I had to record episodes in advance, so kind of one after another. Um, this last week, all the episodes you saw last week, were basically just recorded one after another in one sitting, and what I have to do now is uh, I'm going to just record them every day since I have time, so it's actually a little bit better. All right, let's put all this around here, like so. We're going to double that up, might as well. And it looks like it's becoming night. So let's go to sleep real fast and see what we can do. So I think we found, like, one piece of iron, which you don't really need. Throw out some of this other stuff. Oh, uh, yeah, loads of, loads of kind of randomish stuff today. All right, but we're still good. We're still good. At least we haven't taken any damage this episode. That's the one thing that I'm not... I mean, I'm kind of scared of right now. I hope, I'm hoping we don't take any more damage on um, this episode at all because I don't want to waste, like, a golden apple right now, you know? And I don't want to have to restart this uh, if I die next episode because I take a lot of damage, you know? All right, so let's uh, go to sleep real fast, and then we're going to begin the strip mining procedure. So, strip mining, um, we'll hopefully find gold and, and diamond. That's, like, the main thing I would like to get at this point. And is that – that's not a cave. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, so how low are we at this moment? We are um, 57. Wow, that's actually pretty high. Wow. Okay, so we're going to have to dig down even a bit more, to be honest with you. I didn't even realize. All right, I got to watch out for silverfish. If it does take an abnormal amount to, abnormally amount of long time to mine this stuff, then that's a pretty good indicator that that is a silverfish area. So you got to watch out. Or silverfish spawn, spawn eggs, so just be careful of that. And who knows, maybe by doing this, we might even find another big cave system to check out if we run into it. Maybe like a big ravine or something. I have no idea. If you guys know of any other caves that, that are just on this map or that um, just you guys know of around me, let me know. I don't want to travel. have to travel too far for them, but if they're close, like let's say, I don't know, 100 blocks away, I, I think that's doable. Any more than that is kind of a bit of a journey. I don't want to really waste that. I got to watch out. This gravel could be deadly. I'm trying to get this for flint. For arrows, I'm hoping we'll get eventually get infinity. But just in case we don't, this is good to get kind of out of the way now. Let's go, let's go. Not an axe. That is not the right thing to use, Craig. That is not the right thing to use. Is there anything up there? Just it's all gravel. Let's just all be gravel. Okay. Did not expect that, but all right. All right. So we're at X. Wait. No, I was. Wow. Was I actually looking at X when I was saying how high we were? I was looking. I said X, I think, but I meant Y. So we're at 28. So that's not terrible. 28's not bad. At least we're getting down there. But you, the the better diamond levels are pretty low. Like, you got to get pretty darn low to be able to find diamonds. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Give me some gold or something. I would love gold at this point. Like, diamonds I need just so I can get that enchantment table made and obsidian. But gold would be great for golden apples as well. If I have a lot of gold... In the end, then maybe I can even make a god apple. How sick would that be? All right, so starting to get down to diamond level a bit. Is this dirt or gravel? I think it's gravel. Yep, darn. 
Sometimes when you find dirt underground, it is a good indicator that diamonds and lava are in the area. So that's why I was hoping that would uh, that would lead into that. But it looks like it's just good old gravel, which we don't really need any of right now. Oh man, I could have taken some fall damage right there if I would have mined that. <laughs> could have taken some fall damage. So the ideal diamond finding levels. And sorry, I'm doing uh, something on my other screen here for a second. I'm just going to check. So I, I'm pretty sure it hasn't changed to 1.8. Like they haven't changed, but sometimes they, things like that change. So I'm just going to look. Um, ideal diamond levels Minecraft. Just to make sure I'm not going too low or too high. Uh, it, only, it only appears at Y16 and below. So that's what you want to... Is best to mine level level 12, so that's what you really want to uh, look for. So we're gonna get down to at least to level 12, which we're actually at right now. So we'll go maybe one lower because they could spawn above or below. We'll go a couple lower, just to uh, just be safe. All right, but we should now be good. So let's just start going a little bit, see if we can find anything. Even another big cave system would be awesome, but don't know. Have no idea what's on. Oh, what right there, boys? Woohoo! Let's go. That is absolutely amazing. That is so sick. Wow. Right off the bat, dudes, we found four diamonds. How crazy is that? And you hear that sound right there. I don't know if you guys were able to hear it, but it is a sound. I just learned recently what those sounds mean in Minecraft. They basically mean an area you have not explored. So that means this could lead to a big case. I mean, yes, my friends, this might be a four patch, maybe even more. Maybe even more. Let's get rid of that for a second. Sorry about that. All right, so it's not four. Well, we don't think. All right, don't think it's four. I gotta be very, very careful here. Do not want a creeper coming down here and blowing this up. I don't want gravel to fall on my head or anything like that either. It looks like there's just some of this, what is this, granite or something? That cool new new kind of ore you can get down here. All right, let's uh, mine all this out just to make sure I don't lose any of it. Sadly, I, won't ha I don't have a fortune pick. Um, cause I, well, I, it's impossible for me to have a fortune pick at this point. I haven't been able to enchant anything, so can't really use that. But let's go, my friends. So we got one, two, three... Four, five, six. Is that wait? What is that perfect? So six. You need three for the pickaxe, one for the enchantments, four, and then you can use the other two on a sword. That is absolutely amazing! Wow, Whew. holy cow, that is crazy! Right off the bat, wow, wow, wow! All right, my friends. So that just saved us now a load of time. We'll be able to definitely make the enchantment table on this episode. Just gonna look around and see if we can find maybe even even more diamonds at this point. Don't count on it, but I will, uh, I'll take any I can get, to be honest with you. Take any I can get. My pickaxe is almost breaking, too, so that's never good. That is never good at all. All right, here more grab. Oh, that's actually, I see lava under there. Seems like I saw something. Like I said, when, I, when you see grab or dirt, usually that's a good indicator that something else is over here. So I'm just going to mine out all this, dig out all this, I should say. See if there's anything above. Maybe not, maybe not, it might be a random dirt patch, who knows. It looks like really reddish, I don't know if that's just on my, maybe my monitor or something, but it looks, the dirt looks abnormally like reddish, so. That's why I thought there was like lava in here, like reflecting off of it or something. Alright, maybe not, maybe there's nothing over here. Guess, <gasps> what? What? I wasn't even, I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh. Dudes, how lucky are we getting at this point? Wow. The Minecraft gods are honestly shining on us right now. Look at that. Look at that. We found diamonds. And that was just such a random spot, too. Like, I was just randomly mining into that dirt. Wow. That is insane. It might only be one. Oh, nope. Never mind. Scratch that. It's not one. Let's check this out here. We have at least three. Maybe more. We'll see. We'll see. All right. Let's be safe, though. We don't want, any, don't want to lose any of this right now. All right. Let's get rid of that. It's just going to mine around it just to be safe. Still surprised you haven't led to any caves, any, uh, found any other caves yet close in this area, but hey-ho, we will uh, eventually maybe get to some other ones. Anything else up there? Doesn't appear to be. All right, so there we go. We found another one, two, three, four, five right there. Jeez, dude. So that's 11, and we have that one back at home, so we technically have 12 now. So at this point, just going to mine like this, just random... Um, random like rows but i'm not gonna go down them i'm just gonna mine them just to see if there's any other stuff down here Ooh, redstone i'll take it for the xp oh no darn 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 all right let's get a crafting table down here. this is actually a good spot if we need to find diamonds again in the future i might like just 
keep this as a kind of our main strip mine. It's obviously really close to our house. It's right below our house. So what am I trying to make with this? What am I trying to make another? Well, actually, might as well make another iron pickaxe so I can conserve my other diamond pickaxe when I have to make that. Um, so let's get this made right here. Wow, craziness. We've had absolute crazy luck right here. Like I was saying, the Minecraft gods must be must be um, trying to forgive us of our uh, death on last episode or something. I don't know. I have honestly no idea. Because this was such a random spot too, honestly. Like no one even told me to strip mine. I mean, people said strip mine, but they didn't say under my house. They didn't give me a position to go. So that was just all luck right there. All right, anything down there? Doesn't appear to be. Just got to make sure this area is all lit up because you never know what uh, what might spawn down here if you're not careful. All right, nothing down there. That might be it, honestly. That might be kind of all of our luck right here. Nothing down there. I actually got redstone. I'm going to check it out. You know, when you get some redstone, it's a little bit enticing. So I'm going to check that out a bit. Just get some good XP again. I might get to level 20 right here. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, we will. We will. We're good. There's really no other point to redstone except for potions, but other than that, there's not, no real point. All right, so we're good, my friends. We found 11 diamonds. So technically, we have 12 now. So we're able to now make our wonderful pickaxe, maybe even get an enchantment table this episode. If we can go find obsidian. If we can't find obsidian, we definitely can do it on next episode because I don't think there's any fire patches above the surface easily accessible right here. Maybe the, I know there's some down here and somewhere in a big cave system, but... Um, I haven't really, I don't really remember where those exactly are. We, I've seen lava waterfalls, but not really big patches of lava. So, might have to grind out that a little bit, but this has been a super successful episode. As we're at the beginning not finding anything that might just be kind of a, a fail episode, but we're good. We are definitely good. Look at that, 12. Holy cow. Alright, so let's get rid of some of this stuff that we really don't need at this point. Um, alright, hopefully there's nothing out there. For, to get to us, I don't see anything. I'm just going to throw a bunch of this stuff uh, out for a sec. So we'll get rid of that, get rid of that. Oops, get rid of that, get rid of that. All this stuff um, is pretty useless. Like, we don't need this much cobblestone at all. So get rid of all that. We'll keep the flint, though. That, oh, need that. Definitely keep the flint just in case, you know. Might, uh, might need it for arrows unless we kill some skeletons here or there. All right, so there we go. So let's get this diamond pickaxe made. So we'll need three for that. I, should I make a sword right now or no? We'll need... I think you only need one diamond for the enchantment table. But we have loads of extra now. So we could even make a sword. I just... I don't know. I'm kind of not wanting to make the sword until I can enchant it. And I don't think I should enchant a diamond pickaxe. I'm, eh, I'm kind of like doubting I should enchant that. Unless, if you guys think I should enchant a diamond pickaxe, let me know. But I think a sword would be more useful. Especially since we're just fighting the ender dragon. Um, a, a, um, dying pig would not be useful for that, obviously. So we'll see. We'll see. All right. So we have that made. We have, we need to get more paper to get more books. We need to kill more cows to be able to make more books because we won't be able to do that strong of enchantments at this point. So let's get on the cow hunting at this moment. So let's go buy some more cows. Oh, that's actually night. We'll, we're going to go to bed a little bit here and then we will uh, begin the cow hunting quest. I think I've seen a few around. I just didn't really go after them. Might even cut down some more trees just to be extra safe since there are uh, since there are still some pretty close to our house. All right. But this has been such a successful episode. I can't believe it. Cannot believe we found diamonds that quickly from Strip Mine. I, I was worried that I, since I said guaranteed find diamonds, we wouldn't find any. But actually found some that fast. We're actually almost out of torches as well. Need to make some more of those soon. So do I have any uh, coal? Yes, I do. I'm just going to probably turn... All that into torches. Uh, it won't really hurt. And then we'll throw the rest of that in there. Alright. Cool. Cool, cool stuff. We got the achievement. Earning diamonds. That is absolutely amazing. So right now we got a little bit under six minutes left in this episode. Uh, so we should probably um, just try to stay close to the home. And find some cows. So do you guys see any? I don't see any. I haven't really seen many close to our house. We saw that big patch of them over there. But I don't see any over there right now. Got some piggy wiggies. But I don't see any cows at all. Why are there no cows? That, that extreme hills area over there is huge. I don't know why there are no cows. Um, I don't know. Maybe we have to walk around a little bit and hope they will uh, spawn in as we're kind of walking around. That could be uh, that could be what we have to do here. And I'm, I need to use this wood to make a little bit of a 
little bit of a fenced off area around my house so no mobs can get close to me. And that is something I do want to do. Maybe add some windows to be able to see outside, but I'll probably save those maybe for next episode or an episode down the road. But we got this nice little flower biome here that is, uh, it looks cool, but it doesn't even really give us anything too much, to be honest with you. It does not give us what we need, what we desire. How sick would it be to find a witch hut, like in a swamp biome? It looks like a swamp biome down here, but it's not, but got me thinking, how sick would a witch hunt, a witch hut be? Uh, it'd probably not be that great, because we'd probably die, <laughs> or at least get poison from him, you know? Alright, let's heat up a little bit. I need actually the chicken to get rid of that. Got little squids over here, but still, no cows. What is the deal? Why are you... Oh! Oh, that was close. Why are the cows not wanting to show themselves today? That, I don't know. Man. Cows, cows, come out wherever you are. Please, please, please. Let's go. Oh, I hear a, hear a zombie somewhere. That's not too good. I'm going to get out of the sugar cane just to have it. Oh, right, that's zombies. Where's he at? Oh, he's over there. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa. Is there a spawner there? I see two of them just come out of that hole. I'm going to check that out. If that's a spawner, that is definitely going to be screenshotted right there. Oh, hey, dudes. Oh, I was close to taking some damage there. Um, I kind of want these guys to die before I check it out. Oh, let's get rid of these dudes. I do not want to be put on fire. Fire is like the worst. Oh, yeah, there has to be. Well, I guess there doesn't have to be, but there could be. Alright, let's check it out. Never hurts. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's cutting a little bit close, but we're good. Did not want to die at the end of an episode again. Alright, I guess there's no spawner down here. It seemed like by the rate they were spawning at, that something could be down here, but I guess not. I guess not. So let's get back home, though. It's about, uh, about that time. I don't know really what the point of iron is anymore, um, except to... Well, do we, we already made... Yeah, we already made an anvil, so there's really not an insane point to iron anymore other than XP. And I guess if we had to... If we might... I, well, for iron armor, I guess. So there's, there's still a little bit of a use for iron. Because I don't want to use the iron armor that we have. I mean, I could. It's not too damaged, but it's a little bit damaged. So we'll see. Oh, why can I not pick that up? Okay, we're good. We're good. Um, is there anything that way? It doesn't look like it. Might grab another... Uh, I didn't have my other bucket. I thought I had my empty water bucket on me, but I did not. All right, but let's get back home now. It's uh, We got a little bit under 2.30 left. And then... Um, called an episode today, my friends, but I really hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of our Ender Dragon UHC. Oh, there's more sugar cane. Let me grab that on the way. Um, it's been like one of our most successful episodes yet. It's kind of crazy after that terrible episode last time. Um, we jump right back into it, get an amazing episode, our best one yet. Made a diamond pickaxe. We just now we have to find the obsidian to be able to make the enchantment table. Then we have that made. We can make a sword, we can even make some armor pieces technically with the diamonds that we have. Although I might try to go into the Ender Dragon battle with iron armor. Let me know what you guys think about that. I mean, if I could, I'd use diamond. But I don't know, maybe I should since it is hard difficulty. Um, it's going to make that battle much harder than what I'm used to, especially with all the Endermen running around. So we'll see on that, we'll figure it out. Let's maybe get even uh, some more of this. Some more, uh, do I even, will it still grow if the water flow is kind of uneven? Hopefully it will. This goes nine, right? So it will go like pretty far. And I think the sugar cane still should grow. And hope I don't know if it like has a different growth rate since it's not even water, but I think it's okay. Let's put that there. We can get one on the edge. All right, but we are looking good, my friends. We are looking very, very good right here. Let's even get um, one more out this way. We'll have it going really close to the house because we have. This much sugar cane. It takes a lot, honestly, to make be able to make the uh, to be able to make the bookshelves. But I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you are new to the channel, though, please subscribe. It helps out a ton. Also, follow me on Twitter to be the first to know when I release a new video. If you guys missed last episode, the link down below in the description. So definitely hit that up, as well as the playlist. If you guys have missed any episode in the past, the official playlist will be linked down below. So until next time, guys, have a great day, and see you on my next episode.